Hey, a pleasant good day, everybody. This is Sports 9 News. I'm Joe Boric. And this is going to be the next video reviewing the 2018 draft. We did the 30th and 31st picks earlier today, which were, of course, the 30th, Joey Valino to the Red Wings, and the 31st, Alexander Oleksiev to the Washington Capitals. I will link that video at the end here uh, so you can all watch that. And as always, please continue to subscribe to show the love and support to reach our goal of 180 by Christmas Day, my birthday. Really love and support you all. I really love and appreciate you all for that and support you all for that. <clears throat> um, Morton Count was who they had projected at 27. That did not happen to Dominic Bach, was who the hockey writer had projected at 28th. Uh, neither of those guys were what happened, and neither of them were the positions that happened, since both ended up being defense, and both of those guys are right-wingers. So, for Toronto Maple Leafs, we ended up getting, or they ended up getting Rasmus Sandin, who played for Salt St. Marie. Obviously, he's developed into a great skating defenseman, very solid in the offensive zone, still is developing both ways, but still very young, and still hasn't even hit his prime age yet. He's going to be a hell of a player, and already is a hell of a player for the Toronto Maple Leafs. So, that pick was obviously a great pick for them, and definitely checks out as a top-notch guy that's a part of your future going forward for the foreseeable. So, that definitely seems like a very good lockup there. Plus, he's already been in the NHL consistently and doing good stuff in the NHL, where Alexiev, who I talked about at the Capitals, looks like he's going to be a solid defenseman, but is taking longer to develop and hasn't been up yet. So, he's already on a quicker, a much quicker track than Alexiev. And then when we look at Niels Lundqvist, uh, Lundqvist, who plays for the New York uh, Rangers, uh, got <clears throat> drafted out of Sweden. Um, he obviously is still developing down below. I'm pulling up his numbers as we speak. But he's a player that obviously is really good on the puck and um, is damn near close to being ready to consistently play at the NHL level um, if he's not ready now. So as this thing's loading so we can get our overall numbers here, uh, he's another guy. They also have Zachary Jones in the Rangers, or Rangers organization. Excuse me. He moves the puck very well. Uh, he's a guy that was a great pickup, another guy that's not the biggest defenseman, but really plays the game well and isn't afraid to move up on the play. He's played in 21 games this year. I didn't, I didn't even realize he's played in all of the games, really, with the Rangers for the most part. And he's played very good, four points, um, has very solid defensive numbers, and he's developing very nicely. So just like over Alexia, those these two guys here um, are on a much quicker track, Sandine and Lundqvist, where Alexander Alexia, he could still be very good for the Washington Capitals, the guy I did a video on earlier. But <clears throat> he's just not on a qu as quick of a track. But we already see Niels Lundqvist making a good impact with the Rangers this season, who are a surprise team. I didn't even realize. I thought he played only in the 12 to teens games as far and played a couple games down below. He did not, so I apologize for that. And he's having great success with the Rangers. And then you see, obviously, Rasmus Sandin continuing to develop from the pick that they got from the St. Louis Blues. Imagine if the Blues had Rasmus Sandin also, that the Toronto Maple Leafs were able to grab him from. <clears throat> so I hope you all enjoyed this quick video. Um, coming up next, whenever I may, whenever I do the video, I uh, will do it on Jacob Renard Docker at 26. And Nicholas Bedeen, again, when it, we're sticking with the defense uh, for 26th and 27th pick in the next video. I hope you all enjoyed this short video on reviewing the 2018 draft and who ended up getting selected at the 28th and 29th picks. Peace out, everybody. Stay safe. And please continue to show your love and support by subscribing down below to help us reach our Christmas goal of 180. And hope you're having a great holiday season and enjoy the rest of the great NHL season. Peace out, everybody.